economy. Of course, the bilateral interaction in energy does not limit to that. We are also conducting a flagship project to build the largest Indian nuclear power plant, Kodankalam. Two out of six uh, reactor units have been already connected to the energy network, and four are still under construction. Getting this nuclear power plant to full power output will give an impressive contribution to the energy requirements of uh, India. Which it will help supply Indian uh, enterprises and houses with cheap and clean energy. We presume that we could talk about the construction of small modular reactors and floating nuclear power plants and also non-energy application of nuclear technologies, for example, in medicine or agriculture. We are working with our Indian partners uh, to build new effective international transport logistic routes, including the projects to create an international north-south transport corridor from Russia or Belarus from Russia and Belarus to the Indian Ocean coast. There are large opportunities for bilateral trade uh, due to the broadening of the transarctic uh, transport corridor infrastructure, including its main artery, the Northern Sea Route. There are many other sectors of the economy where Russia and India have garnered positive experience. We are conducting joint initiatives in industry, machine manufacturing, digital technologies, uh, space exploration, and other science-intensive uh, avenues. For example, in accordance with the commercial agreement side during the visit, there will be a large Russian-Indian pharmaceutical factory built in the Kaluga region in Russia. We will be starting the production of high-quality anti-tumor uh, medicinal drugs using the advanced Indian technology.